I have been sent the Bissell Stain Eraser Cordless Spot and Stain Cleaner. It's like a little mini vacuum to vacuum up your stains. And this is going to be a very short little video just to show you it in use. But please head over to my blog post for a full proper blog review. Included in the box is the two cleaning products as well. One's for Boost, which is for old stains, and one's for your spot and stain when you've just done them. Um, you have the main product, the instruction manual, and also the charging cable. Don't forget, as soon as you get your Bissell stain remover, get it charged. It takes about four hours to be fully charged, and then it gives you 15 minutes of run time. There's a little bit of re resistance here when you plug it in, um, but that's fine, it says about it. Your lights will then start flashing, and three lights mean it's fully charged. It's really easy to fill up with the cleaning products. Um, you just use normal tap water and fill it up to the water line. Then pick your choice of cleaning products and fill it up to the formula line. Then you can screw on the lid and it's ready to use. Once this is filled up, you can insert into the little chamber here, clicks in and you're ready to go and start using it. As you can see here, here's the, my stains that are on my carpet, probably toothpaste from the children. Um, I've sprayed on the formula on the cleaning products on here and I've left it to soak on in. You have to check on the back of the bottles how long to leave it. So on the underside of the stain eraser is some little red bristles which you can use to rub in the formula which kind of like loosens all the dirt up like this. And then once you've done this you can turn on um, the stain eraser and it's like a vacuum and it will now vacuum up if you see at the front in that chamber it is now vacuuming up the stain and the stain arrays of liquid and cleaning products and with that it removes the stain um, it's not going to happen straight away it does need quite a few goes over um, but as you'll see in my next photos i'm going to include my befores and after and you'll be able to see how much well they're not there <laughs> As you can see on the left is the before and down at the bottom of the screen you can see those all those little black blobs and then there's the after as you can see they're not there and this is a closer look from above see all my little stains and then on the after they're not there this is a very quick video review so please head over to my blog post to read in more detail about what we thought about the stain eraser and its functions